What's up everyone, welcome back to Westland Survival. Back in here to do our daily bounty hunt quest. We are going to be searching for Alfred Poison in the Mountain Plateau. And it looks like the rewards are stepping up a bit. 1,600 XP, 30 coins, some leather belts and a leather hat. So we need to go to the Mountain Plateau for that. And I've been doing a little bit of work. And as you can see, now I've got myself a um, leather dryer. That's what it's called. And... This little thing I built last time, upgraded all the floors, as well as organised the boxes. So all of these are sorted now. Meaning, when the dealer pops up, in theory, it's not going to take me half an hour to look around everywhere to find everything and then have the um, travelling merchant guy just gone. Right, I'm thinking I should probably put some clothes on. Up in my armour box here. I have some clothes. Right, and I believe it should be this box. There we go. Everything else I need to be making clothes. So we want to make... Um, it's probably some jeans. That'd be quite useful. And some boots. So we just need rope. I believe rope is in here. Look at that. Perfect. Who would have known? Being organised. Actually useful. And I think that'll do. Right. Um, that can come with me. Into there. Right, now, of course, we're going to be taking our super amazing axe with us. The warrior tomahawk. There we go. And what have we already got? Got that equipped now. And, you know what, let's stock up on bandages too. And, of course, we're going to need hatchets to break the wall. It's just gonna. It'll use just over a, a whole hatchet to get it done, right? And can we feed you a little bit? Perfect. There we go. Right. Let's head out to the mountain plateau. And I have just been tagged in Discord. And uh, nothing important. Right. Where? What is the mountain plateau? Is it this one? Yes, it is. Okay. So it looks like it's gradually getting harder each time. So first time, it was green zones, these two, and then we had the dried forest, now we've got the mountain plateau, so I'm guessing tomorrow it's going to want us to come to the pinery. I'd say I'm a sort of 90% sure on that. Now does this also mean that the bandits we're going to be killing are going to be harder as well? I have absolutely no idea. Let's go find out. Bum, bum, bum. Bum. Right, so we are again looking for the dead bodies lying around the map. And I think we've straight up found three of them. No, two of them. Right, let's kill you with my obsidian axe. Right, oh, there's. Yep, we've found three already. Ah, oh, but he didn't actually have what we wanted. Okay. That is a little bit of a letdown. Now, I think it's only the ones with arrows in their head that have fragments of the map. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, because that Indian one. So, Native American, although they're called Indians in this, even though we're not in India. Ah, uh, I hate the goons. Right, got to be careful here. If he does a special attack, I've just got to run. There we go. Right, a weapon broke. That's not the best thing that's ever happened. Hey, there we go. We've got one fragment of the map. Ah, damn. <laughs> oh, well, it was worth a try. Let's get these opened up. I can see a few bodies around me and another box as well. And my phone did go off, but I've... Actually, you know what? My phone's right in front of me. I can check this. Oh, I just got an email from GifGaff saying we're sorry. Okay, this looks like it might be important. Hmm. What's going on? We had a data outage affecting gift card members. Want to say sorry? It goes without saying. We never want to let you down. Blah 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 blah. Do, 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 do. Cool. They're um, reimbursing people that were uh, out of service, but I don't think I was actually out of service. So you can just donate your section to charity. Depends what my credit is. That will have a massive impact on what I decide to do. 
Right. Go away, you wolf. You're dead. Right. I think this will be map part number two. Ooh, that's a weird looking one. I like it. Oh, the wolf killed this guy. He wasn't killed by bandits. And there we go, we've got a wolf tooth as well. Let's get ourselves up to full health. And there we are. Join them all up. We've got our map completed. Now, I would like to have a look around. See if we can find any other bits in the map. Like we did last time. And see if possibly we're able to do it a little bit differently and not combine them until after reading it and see if that means that we'll actually be able to get another map. It's worth a try. Ooh, I'll take that sword. Smeg. Right, a couple tramps to kill. I don't actually think there's any more map-bearing AI people in this zone. Not looking like it to me, at least. Do a quick circuit of it. Jeez, how big is this zone? Okay, the edge is right there. Right, let's kill the tramp quickly. Sorry, I know that's a horrible thing to do. But is that a goon so we can get a bit of XP? Nah. I'm trying to get to level 36. Because at level 36 I'll unlock. What is it I wanted to unlock? The um honestly what I actually wanted was the rocking chair so I could decorate my base a bit. But we don't start getting the good stuff until level 46 and 50. So that is going to take us a while still. Yeah, we're still five levels away. Oh yeah. We need to actually read the map. That will help. There we are. One hour, four minutes. Hide out. Let's go take him down. So this is... Somebody poison. I can't remember... What his name was. It's rumoured that mortal monster appears in the night nowadays and it can only be scared off with a torch. However, if you've got a torch and a steel hammer, you can one-shot the Wendigo. Alright, night time here. I wonder if the Wendigo is actually going to show up whilst we're raiding this. Right, let's switch over to our... There we go. Ready to kick some butt here. Smack. You can't take us. I'm actually really enjoying storing up these. Right, let's go in through here this time. Alfred Poison, that's his name. Alfred's the name. Poisoning is in this game. And he's dead. This warrior tomahawk is so powerful. I love it. Alright, don't really want that. What's he got for us? And I'll drink them. That, I just can't get over how powerful that tomahawk is. Now, let's just, um... Oh, he's stuck. Sorry about that. Nope. <laughs> just failed at hitting each other there. Ah, well. Right, yeah, he should be the last one. There we go. Dead. And I'm going to take his little bit of a sword as well. Because I like keeping up these swords. They're kind of useful. I'll take him over to the place that's got all of the buffaloes, the buffalo pasture and just use up all the swords there killing them that way I just get a load of meat and hide keep myself fully fed and watered not watered right let's head back over to the base but have we got anything nice on us um none of this are really coming useful the wolf fang merchants off a nice price for it. yeah the wolf fang I'm trying to get up a nice stash of them and of course the hide so I can go back up north because I kind of ran out of fur armor and as you can see, I can't craft any yet, which is annoying. Wait, that uses the actual first stuff. What do we use the um, pelt for? No, no, no. The um, grey wolf pelt. Huh. That's a good question. What left do we use the grey wolf pelt for? Maybe it's just another... Um, version of the hide so you can actually use it as double hide 
Alright then, what do we need to do? No bounties available. Ah, that's right, we have to go over to Wasis face here. So we are almost halfway to a level. Let's complete this. Yeah, that was Alfred Poison that we took out. Great job. Goods delivered to your storage. Bye. And look, there we go. Good chunk of the way. And what else did we get? Yeah, we've got leather hats and belts and 30 more coins. What's in this shop at the moment? Anything worth getting? I don't think there is, really. The more bounties you have, the more equipment you'll get. Ooh, this is interesting. So, oh, thanks to whoever just served. As you complete bounties, this unlocks more items. This is like the savings pack. Okay. So there's two more we can do. Oh, I hope the price doesn't increase. Armor jacket. Oh, I thought that was the superior armor. Hmm. We'll have to see what the other things are in there, because at the moment I'd say that's definitely not worth getting. In fact, the only thing actually worth getting, I'd say, would probably be the... I don't know. Currently, the stuff is relatively easy to get in this game, so there's not really any need to actually buy anything. I love this little welcome sign. This is much cooler than the doormat from Last Dead Earth. A skull on a welcome mat. That's just cool. I like it. Alright, thanks a lot, you people. Goodbye.